Good evening, Eureka City Schools Board. My name is Christina Smith, and I am your Visual and Performing Arts Student Representative. January is normally when our middle school students present their end of semester concert, but unfortunately that will not occur this year. Our middle school students look forward to returning to public performance as soon as possible when it is safe and healthy for us to do so. Zane Art students have been working on one point perspective images. The assignment focuses on the element of space or showing depth in an artwork. This is sort of like being able to walk into a drawing. Perspective drawing is difficult due to its precision, use of rulers, and strict format. Envisioning and creating three spaces has obvious connections to math as well. Jewelry students are learning how to work with polymer clay to create custom jewelry pieces. Some even used an oven for the first time with oven baked clay. The skills we learn in hands-on classes like these are often life skills too. I would now like to share with you all some fun arts education facts. Did you know that the arts are recognized as core academic subject under the Federal Elementary and Secondary Education Act? And as of 2020, all 50 states plus the District of Columbia have adopted standards for learning in the arts. According to a new report from the World Economic Forum, it is clear that creativity at work is going to be one of the most important and in-demand skills in the future. Creativity is on the list along with skills such as complex problem solving, critical thinking, and emotional intelligence. What subject can teach those skills better than the arts? With so much concern about anxiety and students' mental health, it is extremely important to note how the arts can help as well. Research from the University of Western Australia suggests exposure to the arts for just two hours every week can improve mental health and overall well-being. Thank you for listening to our report. We miss our normal visual and performing arts activities, but we will be back. Please stay safe and healthy and remember, the arts are essential. Thank you.